what do you want to talk about okay. right here? So sir? I saw this yesterday, and of course, uh, the tournament should have started an hour ago. We should be knee deep in uh, brackets and March Madness right now. But uh, some people have been throwing out brackets online of various topics. We're totally here for all of them. But this one caught my eye yesterday. Yes. So Barrett Sports Media uh, tweeted this out. Sports Center, the greatest anchors tournament. Okay? Uh -huh. 64 Sports Center anchors from current to back in the day, broken down into four regions. The Infuego region, where your top seed is, Dan Patrick. The Way Downtown region, where the top seed is, Keith Olbermann. Mm -hmm. The Bad Beats region, a little more current, guys. SVP, Scott Van Pelt, your top seed there. Uh -huh. And the Booyah region, with your buddy Stuart Scott, the late great Stu, That's right. is the one seed there. You, Rich, I know you're wondering where you are. You are the two seed mm. in the Booyah region. So no disrespect shown your way. You're the two seed. There. I'm the two seed. Uh, all right. Uh, we By the way, first of all, first of all, just to because I'm a stickler for this sort of thing. Sure. Uh, Booyah normally is spelled with uh, an H. Normally it's right. spelled Boo with a Y A. But Stuart wrote it on his shot sheets as Boo Yow. Like Y O W. Y O W. Wow. He would write it in script. Booyah. And by the way, he would write them down every time. Like he would look at his shot sheets and he would scribble all of his the the fr catchphrases. All of his catchphrases. Yeah. So they were off the top of his head during the commercial break when he was seeing the highlight, and but written down so he could execute it. Just want to get that straight out there. All right. Now, have you taken a chance to peek at some of the matchups? I'm just here? looking at it right now. Okay. So there are some great. Nice. Uh, well done. Opening round matchups that caught my eye. Sports TJ's Center as well. Next. Uh, when we were going through this, a great one in the Enfuego region, the eight nine matchup. Currently co-anchors right now on the West Coast, Neil Everett versus Stan Verrett. Okay. The 8-9 seed. Well, instead of walking through the seeds, which ones have you actually had advanced? Okay. How about that? Okay, so I filled out the first uh, the first round. I did the first round. Screw it. How far do you have me advancing, Well, Chris? look, we've only <laughs> gone one round. So you were matched up in the 215s matchup yes. with Randy Scott. Okay. So I, I have you moving on, obviously. All right, Your thank you. second round matchup, by the way, well, was Trey Wingo wow. versus Michael Smith. That's the 2-7 matchup if Trey, if Trey advanced. So I have Michael? Trey advancing. So okay. you are locked in a round of 32 matchup. With Trey, Trey Wingo. Wingo. Okay, now it's the 611 and 314. It's Sage Steele versus Mike Hill. Carl Ravitch versus Michael Kim. Okay, so I have Carl Ravitch advancing right. against Sage Steele. Okay. One of the nicest people I've ever met. Right. Now the 512 is Reese Davis versus Tim Brando. Oh, man. Oh, that's a nice one. Timmy, Tough one. Tough uh, one. I mean, Got Reese moving on. Uh, okay. Reese moving on. Oh, 413, Steve Levy versus Jason Jackson. I think Steve Levy's done the most sports centers of anybody there currently, except for Linda Cohen. For Linda, I think Linda's right? got a Okay, beat, so, so I have Bag of Leaves moving on. Right. Uh, the top of this bracket is Stu Scott versus Nicole Briscoe, who's actually on the air right now. Okay. I got <laughs> Stu moving on. Bill Pito in an 8 9 matchup. This was one of the toughest matchups in this entire bracket. Right. Bill Pito versus one of our favorites. Mike, I know it's your birthday. Carry champion. She, go, she advances. <laughs> National champion. She's she's cutting down the net. <laughs> she's cutting down, down the net. Down the net. net. She's oh my gosh! Net. From the nine she's, seed. That's she's it. like the UConn. Yes, UConn. Give her, give her the Mike, trophy. All due respect. She's like the never nervous <laughs> Purvis Louisville Cardinal. With all due respect to Carrie, Mike, she loses to Bill Pito. I mean, oh, come on. She Billy loses Pito. to Bill Pito. Eisen. Bill Pito is one of the biggest characters I've We're ever judging, met. The, ju the ever. qualifications here is how you do a sports. But here's the thing: it's just like let, let's be honest here. You could take the music down. I want to get to Pat and Pat McAfee and. Uh, so we've only done the first round. We've only done the round of thirty. I want to get to Pat McAfee and AJ Hawk on time. <laughs> let's be honest here. How does Stuart Scott not advance out of his own region? I mean, you know, let's 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 be honest here. Stu's gonna Stu's Stu's. Uh, You're not gonna uh, knock him off in the uh, Elite Eight, dude. Was that when I'd face? Uh, no, I'd, fa yeah, I'd face him in the Elite Eight. Of course yeah, I would. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, I mean, and the question is, is who's the one seed that gets Ooh. knocked down? Look, Who I know Carrie Champion is just going to win. For TJ Jefferson, <laughs> I mean, and she knows, TJ, she knows about you. 
okay, and you too, Mike. She's very well aware (laughs) of how you would have her cutting down the nets. Anything in in which she is in uh, in bracketology, okay? But we're we're talking about TJ. Did you really have Carrie beating Bill Pito? Of course he did. TJ. Of course he did. Don't even have to answer. I'll tell you, the weakest one seed who's going to have the toughest matchup against the two is Keith who would potentially face Chris Berman oh. in the Elite by the, way, by the way, you know they went to school together, right? Like grade school. I think grade school or, or middle school or, or something like that. They've known each other forever. Holberman versus Berman. It would be Dan versus Bob Lee in the way, one, oh. two, and then Fuego. And Van Pelt versus Linda Cohn in the Bad Beach region. You, you could make an argument Man. that uh, SVP could potentially lose in the Sweet 16 to either Mike Tarico or John Bucci Cross. Tarico is a five seed? Are you out of your mind? I mean, that's crazy. Bucci I man agree. is a strong four in the Bad Beats region. Just saying. I mean, the other five, Brian Kenny's a five. Is Robin Roberts a five seed? I do what have. Are you talking I, mean, about? I do have some yeah. first round upsets in mind. I have Kevin Nagandi knocking off John Anderson in the way downtown oh, region. I John mean, Anderson is one of the best sports center anchors I, I've I, I totally, was, I he totally was, he was, get it. He was flat out new when I started doing sports centers with him and he's he has done tons of them. He is funny. He's he's a good dude too. John Anderson he's a good guy. also strikes me as the type who tells you how funny he is. No, he's totally not. get it. He's not. Totally he's, get it. I, I will I will stand up he's for John Anderson. He's one of those Anderson. guys, oh, I went to Missouri. My no, journalism school is superior to he, yours. He, he would never do it. Like, from my memory, he would never do that. All right, my other 413 upset, I have Lindsey Zarniak knocking off Hannah Storm. No. Just saying. Notre Dame's finest. My gosh. Hannah. Anyway, this is a lot of fun. Uh, we'll retweet it, print I'm it out. Honored, I'm honored at least to be seated yeah. into the Elite Eight, so thank you for that. Yeah, fill your guys' out. Send it to us on Twitter. We'll retweet it. This is a lot of fun. Rich. We'll post our final fours and, later today. And congratulations to Carrie Champion, Champion oh, winning two-thirds of the uh, of the vote for you. Carrie Champion will not be winning my to, Congratulations to Carrie Champion cutting down the nets. Very good. <laughs>